was born, parents named him Samuel. To us, he was our SWAT brother, Squirt. And he wasn't just a cop, he was one of the best. I just came from a funeral, had to hurry. You don't want to be late for the first night of class. I signed up for an acting class. No kidding? But what are you going to do? Drive out to California? Knock on Steven Spielberg's door? He's going to say, boy chick, I've been looking for you? You're a SWAT cop. I'm Kate. Kate, Ryan. You know, I've seen this before. I see it a lot. People who are witty at work, clever at a party, and all their friends tell them you should be an actor. But it's not that easy, this life on the stage. I don't know. Sometimes I don't know about the job anymore. You found a more felony arrest going to the store to get ice cream than most guys do in a 25 year career. And now you want to tell me your heart's not into it? Squirt goes and dies on me. Now he's hanging out with Rock Hudson wannabes. Squirt had friends like that. And look what happened to him. You couldn't have ordered Squirt not to be who he was. And if your brother wants to become an actor, you can't order him not to. Um, Squirt died about a year ago. Was he shot? No. Um, complications from AIDS, HIV. I'm sorry to hear. Since when? Since when did you find yourself having to hate somebody just because they're gay? Since when? Since when? Since Squirt died, okay? See, I don't think you understand what happened here today. Yeah, I know exactly what happened. A SWAT cop of 15 years just left his team hanging in the winds, so we can go play make-believe with a bunch of goofballs who don't even know how to spell the word responsibility. If you ever talk to him like that again, I'll smack you. 